her. Can I move this with triangle? Yeah. Yeah, I should have been lit on fire there, but I guess I wasn't. That one is also... How am I going to do this? I thought I was going to land there and then pull over the thing and then move it, but like... That thing is absolutely going to burn the crap out of me when I jump there. I'm not going to have time to grapple this over and get on top of it again. That is, there is no way there is enough time for me to grapple this after jumping. Like, even if I time this well. I wonder if I can just take damage and get through it. Probably not. Am I missing something here? Surely this isn't how the game expects me to do this. That just seems ridiculous. I need like a second barrel or something. I, I guess I need to try it once. Just jump again. Yeah, okay. Well, I may as well pull you back over now. We didn't start the fire. It been when is it the whip turning? We didn't start the fire. Does this one never stop? This one never stops. I'm gonna do the exact same dang thing again. Oh, she can kind of just jump it, actually. You don't even need the the box. Um, I probably need the box now to get over this. Maybe there's a way up and over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I already figured it out. Don't worry. What is this? God of War Ragnarok? You don't need to tell me the answer that quick. Moving these things is so awkward sometimes. They don't move how you think they would. What on earth is this? The giant crazy fingers of death? Mm-hmm. This looks like my garbage disposal. I hope you're not leaping through there, Lara. There must be a way to stop them up. I certainly hope so. Yeah, it's not gonna work. Box time. Lilith, welcome to stream. How you doing? Mm, yeah, my head is in that blade right now, but whatever. Thank you, PS2 hitboxes. I just want to push it forward, but every time I try to move it in a direction, the game is like, oh, you want to turn around and pull it instead of push it? And I'm like, no, I just want to push it. Pushing it would be faster. Why do you keep trying to make me turn around to do this? Oh, my goodness. Please. Just let me push it forward. It, it it will not. It keeps forcing me to the left. There you go. Jeez. Get get in there. And then I'm taking this back. We didn't start the fire. What's going on in here, huh? Come on. Come, come on. Come, come. There you go. Oh, hello. I have a feeling I'm going to need to take you with me. Octagon, welcome to stream. Game is pretty good. It's got some classic, like, PS2 jank here and there, but overall, it's been a pretty fun time. Hmm. 
I don't know if I just need to go forward here or what. I also don't know why I have two boxes. Because it seems like I can always just, like, block the thing in my way with the box and then bring it around. Like, pull it out from the other side, like this right here. But I'm expecting the game at some point to be like, you need a second box, which is why I keep bringing two of them. Because otherwise, why would they have given me another box? Do I need it for this fire in some fashion? No way you're long jumping that. No, I'll have to make a path. But it might have been worth trying just to hear you lads scream about it. Is this why I need two boxes? How am I gonna make a path, though? Is it... Am I gonna do this? Like, put this here... Get on this box... And then yank this one? Like, that? no, that's not really working at all, is it? I'm just gonna... Jump it? Yeah, cool. Lever! I didn't need those boxes anyway. I don't think that box puzzle section went how the devs wanted it to go, but I didn't really see how they wanted me to do it any other way without it being really annoying. Oh, hello. Hey, Alistair. Why don't you head on down there and stand on that play for her? Why don't you go down and hold that door open? Somehow when I pull on this, my weight gets lighter and I no longer hold down the pressure plate. Hmm, okay, I see. Is this just water? What is this about? Can I not pull this? Okay. And it's just water. I don't know why I can interact with all of these, uh... Candles. Or, uh, torches, rather. You see that crate up on the shelf over there? You could use that on the pressure plate. It's not a crate. It's a coffin. Someone's revered ancestor is in there. Hmm... Well, sucks to be them, I guess. Oh, right there. Okay, I wasn't sure where they were pointing me towards. Yo! That kind of worked somehow? And then I could get that treasure by doing it with that one, but I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't care about the treasures. Why can't I hit this? Hit it from here? I thought I'd be too far away. No, we're good. And it's a coffin, all right. Oh. Okay, I see. Now these are like this so that I can uh, use it to pull the coffin while I'm standing on it. I appear to be too far away to yoink the closest one. Really? I don't think I can be any closer than this. What the heck? Oh, well, I guess I could pull it, like, here and then jump onto it. Okay, I guess I have to do this. Come here. No, get on the thing, Laura. Excuse me, Miss Croft. Here we go. Now we're talking. Let go, let go. And then this one next. Got it. I thought I missed it. And then we have to hit the one right above the thing. I can do this. I hit the wrong button. That's my bad. Whoop. Nailed it. What is happening? I am not touching the right stick right now. I don't know why the camera is doing this. Hey. I did it. 
Come here. Yeah, get on. And here's your final, final resting place, sir. If we're through having fun, it's time to get back to business. Yo, we're gonna defeat the Huns. I'm in the water again. How does this keep happening to me? What am I stuck on? Oh, this is another coffin. Okay. I'll take this time to adjust some travel arrangements I made. It shouldn't take too long. Coward. Don't worry, Laura. I've still got an eye on you. Probably won't be able to hear each other too well when you're underwater, though. There is a god. I am here now. Where, uh... Where am I going? Was I supposed to jump up right there? I think I was supposed to have jumped up right there. Whoops. Whoopsie. Get over there. Come on. Come on. Stupid current. Where's my dolphin kick, Kingdom Hearts 1? No, not making that jump. All right, this is gonna be annoying because I didn't realize I needed to jump immediately, which is kind of frustrating. And I guess I need to snag that one way over there next. Is it too far away? I can't get this close enough to jump. At least I don't think I can. I really hate what it does to my camera angle. There we go. Okay, I was close enough. I hate that it auto turns my uh, camera angle while I'm pulling on something with the grapple. Hello there, lever. What do you do? You gonna open up this coffin pathway for me? I assume, yeah, sure enough. Hello. Back on the coffin. Where to next? That is a question. Man, I bet speedrunners, like, annihilate this section of the game somehow and do it super fast. Am I just jumping over this? This is where the current seems to be pushing. All right. Nice point of no return looking place. Hello, I am here now. What the heck am I doing? Do I hear a whale? What was that? This reminds me of that area in Okami. Orochi's cave in Okami. Will you look at that? Oh, this is brilliant. See how framey it got there? Okay, cool. It said to shoot that, but I was like, surely this is a pull. Okay. Huh. What does pulling these cages down accomplish? I'm not sure. Nice checkpoint. Is this gonna do anything? Hmm. Maybe I need to pull this over first. Well, now I could jump onto that and that would swing me around, but like, what would that do for me? I feel like that wouldn't really accomplish much. Unless maybe I could then swing over to this to get over here, to get up there? Maybe? What's going on with that up there? I don't think I can reach it.
That stops right there. There's no way I'm gonna be able to jump from this all the way over to that, though. That is an insanely too far- Oh, you know what? I bet I'm gonna- when I jump up, it's gonna give me the prompt to grapple onto that, and I'm gonna grapple across, like, make my own rope swing. Okay, I think I got it. I forgot that was a game mechanic for a second. Let's give that a try. Up. Nice, nice. Let's see if this works how I think it will. Totally does. I jumped too early, idiot. I should have just waited and got a swing going. Come here. Let's try again. Up. This is a cool little parkour section. I dig this. Come on, Laura. Let's do this, Miss Croft. Make sure we get enough of a swing. There we go. Now we're talking. Let me just go up and around over here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Chat, I'm something of a gamer myself. Almost didn't hit triangle there because I wasn't paying attention. I don't know where this is like gonna end up. Oh, I'm all the way up here now. I, I guess this is where I wanna be. I got a checkpoint out of it. What was the deal with the cages? What were they about? Mine. Thank you. Up. Yo, I'm here to raid your tombs. Real. They're all here. The court of Camelot. You're sure about this? King Arthur, who washed verily of ye loins of Uther Pendragon? Hmm? I've no doubt about the authenticity of this tomb, Alistair. Arthur was the 11th century figure that became legend. The once and future king was as real then as the air I'm breathing now. I don't know, Laura. Excalibur. The sword in the stone. That's how it always goes, isn't it? Pardon? Swords in stones, Alistair. They're part of the monomyth. There wasn't just one Excalibur or one Merlin. We keep seeing swords and deuses all over the world because they were everywhere. So you're saying that everywhere they went, they raised up kings, shaping the course of human destiny? Well, it's a possibility. Who? And what happened to them and their swords? Perhaps they're in Avalon. It's as good a place as any. Except our Merlin was killed and our Excalibur was left in pieces in the hands of the locals. So where's Avalon? I don't know. On the other side of the looking glass, perhaps? What on earth are you talking about? Sup, bro? All sounds like a bunch of hooey magical nonsense to me. It says Bedivere returned a fragment of Excalibur to Arthur after the other pieces were carried off by the knights. Where did they go? To find Avalon, perhaps. The quest for the Holy Grail. Lancelot, Galahad, Percival, and Bors. Their tombs are empty. It says this fragment was left with Arthur to help him leave this mausoleum when the time came. Perhaps it will help me instead. Mm, perhaps. Murden? Gwynhava? Shout out to Lancelot, he's my favorite. I just think his name sounds neat. Tristan? Tristan Taylor? From Yu-Gi-Oh? What's this about? Why you, uh, why you bouncing like that? Alright. Um... I don't really know what you want me to interact with next. That doesn't look particularly strong. We're gonna- we're gonna bust open the chrysalis he's in? Yeah, what could go wrong? Use the pistols. The 
This is not working. Um, oh, I didn't see these other things up above, actually. So I have to do something with them, presumably. This isn't gonna go far enough, is it? Let's find out. Yeah, not at all. Hmm. 